Dexter Regional High School took a pause to enjoy the amazing weather today and focus on students' mental health. It's an initiative put in the works for the second year in a row by the school's positive action team. Sarah Whaley takes us to Dexter to check out what took place on their mental health day. The goal is to just slow down a little bit and like take time to really enjoy things in the school setting. Youth across the U.S. have undoubtedly gone through many changes over the years. That's why Dexter Regional High School put a pause on their daily school activities for a mental health day. We get together as a school. We have a little bit of a meeting in the beginning to talk about some of the importances of uh, mental health. We have students do that usually to, to really connect with the other staff and uh, peers of our class. Some students said they enjoyed starting their day on a positive note and realized the importance of checking in with themselves. I think it's important because a lot of people don't like express their feelings and stuff and uh, it's a good way to just relieve stress. Sydney Fogler is a senior and was one of the students involved in the school's positive action team and brought the idea to Dexter. We talked about the issues that we were seeing in our community and ways that we could possibly do something to like help it and improve our schools and our town. Bree Clayton said mental health has been an issue surrounding high school students for a while and she's happy to be a part of newer efforts. In the 2019 Maine Integrated Youth Health Survey, so before the pandemic even started, 32% of students had felt so sad or hopeless in the last year that they stopped doing their usual activities. And she understands it's hard taking that first step. It's scary to take that first step, especially when you don't know some of the resources around here. Which is why they partnered with Panquist, Partners for Peace, and more to host a table of information to students in the Prevention Cafe. Although Fogler will be graduating soon, she hopes the Mental Health Day remains a tradition and youth in her community are always heard. A lot of the times people don't respect the feelings of teenagers because we're still young and they don't think that we've been through enough. It's so important that you talk about it and continue to talk about it. It's so amazing to be a part of. C.R. Whaley, WBI-TV5 News, Dexter.